I will make no other introduction to the following discourse than that as the importance of our being strong at sea was ever very great, so in our present circumstances it is grown to be much greater. Because, as formerly our force in shipping contributed greatly to our trade and safety, so now it is become indispensably necessary to our very being. It may be said now to England, Martha, Martha, thou art busy about many things, but one thing is necessary. To the question, what shall we do to be saved in this world, there is no other answer but this look to your moat. The first article of an Englishman's political creed must be that he believeth in the sea, etc. Without that there needeth no general counsel to pronounce him incapable of salvation here. We are in an island, confined to it by God Almighty, not as a penalty, but a grace, and one of the greatest that can be given to mankind happy confinement that has made us free, rich, and quiet. A fair portion in this world, and very well worth the preserving, a figure that ever hath been envied, and could never be imitated by our neighbours.'